sorry for. This isn't your fault. No. About earlier today. The flyers. Get. I should apologize. It's just this place brings back bad memories for me. You know, I, I never understood why you left. And one day you were just gone. Look, I didn't say it before, but I'm glad you're back. I feel safer with you here. <laughs> Everything's just been falling apart around us, you know, but you just keep moving forward. I don't have a choice. Yes, you do. You could just leave again. Alex, tell me what you know about Silent Hill. I know that Joshua and I were told a hundred times never to go there. Yeah, my mom was pretty strict about it too. Yeah, well, your parents were right. I tell you. But it all fits. All those things we've seen in Shepherd's Glen, the nightmares. What do you mean? Silent Hill is what I mean. This has bad history. Always has. You've been there? Didn't need to. I heard enough. Why decide to move east? I was looking at a job in Bronx, working with the police. At the time, they had this cop. I can't remember her name, but she'd gone to Silent Hill. Well, what happened to her? No one knows. We found a bike outside of town. But I'd heard rumors about the people who lived there. Let's just say they're not too friendly to people who don't share their beliefs. The order. Yeah. And when I met with your father about working in Shepherd's Glen, he told me I would never have to go to Silent Hill. I guess there's some sort of irony here. Do you really think we're gonna find anyone there? I took it from my mother's room the morning Laura disappeared. I haven't taken it off since. Look at that hair. Shut up. Jerk. <laughs> I'm just happy to see that something's gotten better since I left. Alex, there's a light up ahead. I think we might be at the pier. What should we do? Turn off our light. I don't want anybody to know we're coming. Let's go! 